minutes. Everybody asks me, how come you never get dirty? But I do get dirty. I have like wiping sweat with dirty arms and getting it all over my face. So it is false that I do not get dirty. Deep in the woods, deep in the woods, it was raining real good. This pops up. Ten inches down, ten inches down with a solid sound. Mule shoe, mule shoe, you're so sweet. I'm gonna Hello. take you home with me. I dug it up, I dug it up for my baby. But he doesn't want it, no. Oh my gosh, this is the coolest thing ever. Wash your hands. As you can see, I just got done digging. But I wanted to make a segment and update you on what I've been up to these past few weeks because you haven't heard from me. But I've been out there and I've been digging and I've been recording footage and then I'm just not finding anything so I'm not giving you guys videos. So if you want videos of me not finding anything but still having fun, let me know and I'll put out videos regardless of what I find. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun these past few weeks so check it out. Alright, I'm working on my first hit and I got a friend here. Oh my gosh. This cat wants to be best friend. Hey kitty. Say hi, look. <laughs> Alright, so I got a storm coming in in the distance. And my buddy Ricky drove up from Allentown oh, to come no. and dig with me. There she goes. <laughs> we decided to metal detect first. Oh yeah, his first fine metal detecting. Solid gold, baby. Yeah, Ricky's a bottle guy. <laughs> so for him, this is really stepping outside of his comfort zone. But he's doing all right. Show the camera what you got. What is it? Do you know what it is? Ah, oh, bug in the ear. What is it, sissy? Do you know what it is? Yes. Yeah, but do you know what it is? Yes. It's a shotgun shell. Just check and show. Just check and Alright, so I'm back at the site where I found the Civil War button. Um, the stone store right here. And actually the owner just told me that in a couple weeks it's coming down. Um, because the fire damage was just too much and it can't be saved. So that's pretty disappointing. But they are putting a monument up that tells the history of the building and place of the store. So I thought that was really neat. Now that'll stop your heart real quick. I got the edge of that. Ah, full tap. It was a good signal, but no go. Darn it. All right, we got half a horseshoe. Kind of moved away from the store here. And I'm back in this field where I heard the gunshots the last time. So hopefully nobody tries to shoot at me. Because that would seriously ruin my day. But yeah, the owner is over there. He owns like all these properties. He rents them out. The whole town of Clear Springs, which isn't very big at all. He owns all the houses. Um, he's over there digging really deep holes. So I think I'm gonna hop in there when he's done and run my detector to see if there's anything way far down. Um, we'll see. We'll see if he's still here or doing it when I wrap things up or yeah it's really hot I can't really think my whole mind is like but I'm having fun and that's what matters check out the sunburn oh yeah and my shirt relic recoverist I got shirts made so if you want a shirt make sure you go to my website www.relicrecoverist.com and I have guy shirts too they're not all girl shirts but all right back to digging I got sweat dripping out my nose it's kind of hot there's like no trees Oh yeah, <laughs> that guy's talking to me. Um, I found half of a horseshoe, so back at it. All right, so I got our first coin of the day. Oh, let me see it. Looks like it could be modern. It is. It's a nickel. It's an S nickel. I don't even know what that means. I just saw the S. 1942. It's 
really nice too. It's in good condition. Usually I take them up and I like nick them with my shovel and they're real ugly. So yeah, 1942. Woohoo. All right, back to it before I melt. All right, like any good metal detecting hobbyist, I rechecked my hole. And I see the rib of something that looks like a dime. Oh, it's a mercury dime! Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm so excited! I love mercury dimes, they're so pretty! I'm so excited. Okay. And it's so shiny. They always come out so shiny. It's a pocket spill. This one is 1942. Same year as my nickel. Alright guys, we got a huge storm blowing in. It seems like that's always the case when I'm out here. But, um... I think I'm gonna dig a couple more holes until it starts to rain and hopefully not get hit by lightning because I'm in an empty field. <laughs> we'll see. Just got this. Really sure what it is. Apparently it's the letter B off of a mailbox. Oh, there's something on the back too. The letter M. B M. starting to sprinkle, but I see the storm and I see the clear sky behind the storm. So it might just be a quick storm. I looked at the radar and it looks like it's just one cell moving. So, all right, I'm gonna keep going. All right, so everybody asked me, how come you never get dirty? But I do get dirty. I have like wiping sweat with dirty arms and getting it all over my face so it is false that I do not get dirty but I thought maybe I could sit in my car and wait out this storm and it looks like it might pass there's like a dark cloud over there but we shall see I still have like two hours before I have to pick up the kids so I'd like to keep digging I dug two silver coins, so that's awesome. There must be more out there. Anyway, we'll see. All right, I'm back to it. And it's raining, getting a little wet. But I just found another coin. Let's see what it is. It's green, where did it go? I just saw it a second ago. Did I lose it? I swear there's a coin in there. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I knew I'd find it. Doo -doo -doo -doo. It's a buffalo nickel. It's more rain. It's a buffalo nickel. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to read it right now unless a raindrop conveniently lands right on top of it. Maybe I'll wipe it on my legs. A little money. Yeah, there's a bug on my face. Oh, all right. I don't think I'm going to get a date off of it yet. I'll have to look again when I get home. But yeah! Buffalo nickel! Alright. For a second it started hailing. I was like, alright. Time to go stand on the porch. So, as you can see... Just a little dirty. <laughs> I'm hoping to get back out there because... The sky is clear over there. So I just gotta wait it out. I just found something. So cool. I 
pretty. Look at that. It's like the freaking crown jewel. Then brass. Looks like brass. Oh my gosh, I just sat and I forgot it was raining and now my butt's all wet. Look at that. It's gold plated. Oh my god. Alright, we just got another coin. My butt is getting wet. It doesn't matter because I'm having so much fun. I think it's modern. Oh, there's another one in there. Yes, it's just a... Oh, no, it's a dime. Not a dime. You guys know we love dimes. I think Sierra's house cursed me forever finding dimes. There's another one right there. It's a nickel. Just a regular modern nickel. I wonder if there's anything else in there. I better check it. And my phone's about to die, so I'm gonna have to cut this video off. Which totally sucks. Because we're having so much fun. The pinpointer's going nuts. Nope, nothing else. Another coin. This will never get old. Do you see it right here? I think it's a coin. It's not a coin, but it's still cool. It's a key. It's rather old. It's still neat. It's going in the keeper pocket. All right, last dig for the day because my phone is going to die. I need to catch this on camera. And unfortunately, my shovel rips through it. But it's an old watch. It's a really cool old watch. I think. Very fancy. Oh, come on. Oh no, it's breaking. Oh, that is so disappointing. Ooh. Oh my goodness, it would have been so beautiful. And now it's in pieces. What a bummer. Look at it right there. <sighs> Alright. Well, it's been good, guys. I will catch you next time. <sighs> Alright, so unfortunately my phone died. shirts, make sure you check out my website at uh, www.relicrecoverist.com and if you use the code YOUTUBE, capital Y-O-U-T-U-B-E, I will give you 20% off. So, I like you. <laughs> so make sure you check that out. Um, and until next time, catch you later.